are going to send things over to our Carly Van Cleve. She is at Tuscarawas in Tuscarawas County at the high school this evening. Carly, I know there's a memorial set up there. Those are those people are remembering obviously all of those victims and there is a big support system there in that community tonight. Carly, what are they telling you about those impacted? Yeah, Kate, that memorial was just cleaned up not long ago. It was right back here at the high school behind me. They cleaned it up as the students were leaving for the day. One of the people honored in that memorial was an English teacher. Take a look at what I learned about her today. A community in mourning after six people died in a bus crash Tuesday, just east of Columbus. Those six people, all a part of the Tusky Valley High School family. It's a nightmare of every district. Bob Alsept is the superintendent at the Buckeye Career Center. That's the Tusky Valley's vocational school. One of the victims, Mrs. Shannon Wigfield, was an English teacher there. She was a ray of light for our community, to, to students and staff, and, and uh, we, we miss her greatly. Alsept says Wigfield worked there for 24 years. She would often chaperone events and she loved planning their annual prom. She was much more than just a teacher. Um, she really took an interest and made those folks, the, the students, feel good about themselves. He says he can't imagine how the students are feeling, but the Tusky Valley is a close community that will give all the support they can. It's really difficult because a lot of our um, Students, maybe this is the first major loss they've had in their life, and dealing with that is difficult. Um, we had staff members who had her as a student, and all of those things together, uh, it makes it a difficult day. A difficult day, especially for the loved ones of the victims. Six lives taken far too soon. Just prayers of peace and strength. Um, we're we're going to battle through this. Now, I did get a chance to talk to a couple of students today here at the high school. They described to me what it was like at school today as they honor those lives taken. I'll have that story coming up tonight on the news at 6. But for now, reporting live, I'm Carly Van Cleve, ABC 6 News. Thank you, Carly. And you're able to follow this investigation every step of the way, even when we're not on the air. Just be sure to download our ABC 6 app, and you can sign up to receive alerts that will send to your phone anytime there are breaking developments.